Hey, what's going on, guys? It's Zafete bringing us another video, and today is Wednesday. Yo, we're getting a back to back before Evil Japan? Are you serious? Because today we got Ling Xiao Yu. Unbelievable. T Yo, back to back days. This is sick. Yo, Bandai Neko is doing a big right now, so I'm wondering what we're going to do at Evil Japan if we're releasing so much gameplay right now. But today, Ling Xiao Yu is on the screen. We got some gameplay. Uh, I'm excited, uh, as I am a secret Xiao Yu lover. Uh, and I'm also a king main. Doesn't go together, real. You know, it just doesn't go. Just doesn't go together. All right. <laughs> hey, what's going on, guys? It's Afete bringing us another video. Man, today is Wednesday. We're doing back to back trailers here. Day by day trailers, I guess. Bandai, uh, what's going on here? Because we got Ling Shao Yu gameplay here in front of my face, and I cannot believe it. Dude, I'm a king player, but I also really like Shao Yu as a character. In terms of gameplay, I really like her. But I'm a king player. I hate this trailer right now. <laughs> but I also really, really love it. So I'm actually excited to see how they're going to flare her up in terms of character, gameplay. Because uh, she seems, uh, you know, a little tamed. But um, let's see what they have acquired for her in this game. I'm really excited. Uh, let's see what she got. Let's get it going. I hope something involves, like, Panda. I was talking about it with a friend. We were hoping, like, you know, maybe they add Panda to it. Who knows? All right. I'm very excited for this. Get ready for the next battle. Okay. Dancing Phoenix. I like that. That's good. She sounds different. Okay. Oh my god. Art of Phoenix, okay. Oh, what is that? Oh, it's a launcher! Oh no. Okay. She has a stance. Oh my god. Did you already have Art of Phoenix? <laughs> three, down four. Maybe three to beat Smash. Down four, two. Nice. Okay. That's a good engager. Nice. Oh, back three to heat engager. Okay, down back one to heat engager as well. Nice. Ooh, that's a lot. Oh my god, okay, how did it work? <laughs> Damn, beat the fuck out of it. Okay. Cutesy jumpy stuff. Oh no. Alright, so let's break it down here because Xiaoyu looks great. Don't get me wrong. Xiaoyu looks amazing. I love the gameplay. Her face is still beautiful. It looks slightly a bit older than Tekken 7. Um, but here's the thing she is not as flashy. Now, if you looked at all the other characters, right, they, they had cinematics that showed their flashiness or, you know, something explosive, right? She has none of that. She's very simplistic with this one, which is what I like. Now, they could have did her some justice, gave her some more flash to make sure that she stood out like the others. But she, you know, she definitely is more simplistic than the, than a lot of the other characters. So we're going to break it down here. She looks great. Like, it looks amazing. I do love the gameplay. I will be playing her, of course, because I do know how to play her. Uh, but she has a lot of new things here. She's like that stance. Don't know why she has it. <laughs> she has RP. Okay, so jab one down forward two. And then gets into stance with, a, with looks like a tracking four. And it's a low out of that stance, which is insane already. Like, that's a mix <laughs> off of a jab. <laughs> you, have to deal, you have to deal with an immediate mix afterwards. That's insane. So, standing four alone does not... This is a nerf for a lot of characters, too. Standing four does not launch anymore, right? Magic four is not magic four anymore for a lot of characters. But it does not down still. And she gets an immediate flip afterwards, which is guaranteed and gets her artifacts. Down back to her version of Waning Moon. I mean, it falls, right? And falling is the answer to that. But she also gets, like, you know, down 3, 4 guaranteed now. So I'm wondering if there's, if there's a different answer to her version of Waning Moon, right? Alright. Okay. So it gets a full launcher there with uh, two, down 4, 2, till the 1. Uh, gets her uh, original stuff, but they change it. Down for one. 
back turn one two which is the upward bound four two one stance and then gets her palm right and she gets that actually in dom back uh one plus two when you hold it and you do one it actually makes some it makes some guaranteed stuff happen uh but in this uh stance it's 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 actually her new mid which is insane so it gets to parry right and then immediately does down back one plus two she had enough time for that which means that this shit is quick <laughs> Nina reacts, tries to press something, gets kicked. Down, uh, I believe that's back three. Yeah, so back three, I want to say two. Which is sick. Back three, what's a plus? Down four, getting counter hit it, right? Not the biggest launcher in the world, but gets heat smash right after this. Making guarantee. Down four, two, four, two, one. Four, one plus two for the shoulder. Four, four, one. AOP, two, one, which is heat engager. Up four, two plus four into the freaking twin kicks at six. That's sick. All right, so let's go back a little bit. Let's go back. Let's have it. All right, so oh, it, okay, so it's back three one. All right, so back three one. Heat engager. Four two one. And gets that uh, that same mix up there, but then also four till the three is guaranteed up. There. Down back one as a punish, and it's a heat engager. And then uses uh, her regular stuff into up back three plus four, or oh, I think it's up three plus four. One of those. Maybe it's up for 3 plus 4 now. Uh, and then uses that uh, as her upward bound. And then gets into AOP immediately. And then 2 1. Not pushing back. AOP 1 plus 2 is a counter hit launcher. Which is sick. And then we get the rage on here. Beating him the fuck up. Sick. She looks great. I love her character. It looks great. I don't like that she has Waning Moon. <laughs> which is telling me that Wang is never ever coming back. He is dead. <laughs> but she does have Waning Moon, which is sick. Uh, I love this character. She definitely is a, a wonder with Tekken because she breaks the game so much. <laughs> but I wonder if AOP is going to be a more prominent thing. Uh, it seems like AOP is kind of out of the question in terms of being evasive as much as Tekken 7 or any other previous game she's been in. Um, but I'm sure it does the same, it has the same properties, I'm very sure. Uh, but not as prominent in this trailer. But, what is prominent in this trailer is that freaking stance, right? And it has a lot of mix-ups with it, which is sick. So, whew, two gameplay and trailers back-to-back -back here. I wonder if they're going to release somebody <laughs> tomorrow, who knows? <laughs> That'd be sick. Well, other than that, we are here for it. Before Evo Japan, we're getting two back-to-back. -back. Maybe it's going to be triplets quadruplets who knows but i'll be here for it and i'll catch you guys in the next one peace out